And what's up fellas, today I'm going to show you the difference between global truss and the adjustable totals. Hey, what's up fellas, what's up? So another video for you guys. Uh, today's video, I'm going to show you the differences between global truss and uh, adjustable totems. Uh, first off, how are you guys doing with this quarantine? This is my second week at home on board. I don't know what else to do. Uh, so pretty much, I guess I came up with this video idea. Let me know what else, uh, if you guys come up with anything else that I can do for you guys. Uh, I know I have a bunch of gig logs I want to do. But uh, also, I know you guys like the comparison video. So today, we're going to compare the Global Trust uh, totems and uh, adjustable totems. Uh, differences, pros and cons. But um, again, hopefully, you guys are staying safe uh, in this quarantine. I'm not sure how many of you are able to work. For me, I'm not working my regular job. They sent us home since last week. Uh, as you guys know, most events have been canceled or postponed for now. So it's a little tight right now. A little tight on money. Uh, we'll see how this uh, will go over. But hopefully it's over pretty soon. Hopefully it doesn't prolong any longer. But let me show you here what I have. Let's start off with this. Uh, so don't mind all the mess that I have over there. But let me flip this down a bit. As you can see right here, I have the... This is the adjustable totem. This come in two bags. One of the pros about the adjustable totems is easy to carry. As you guys can see, I can fit everything in two bags. When you buy them, they come already uh, with bags uh, versus the, sorry, I'm kind of looking backwards here, <laughs> but you have the six and a half foot totem with the base plates. Uh, as you can see the difference, these are not as, uh, well, they have pros and cons, the, and I will show you. Uh, one of the biggest things that I can think of right now uh, with the t Global Trust, uh, where am I? Yeah, I'm looking at the uh, screen, I'm backwards. But uh, with the Global Trust, I feel more comfortable hanging TVs on it. They're a little heavier, so I've done it many times. TVs is not a problem. I have not put a TV on the adjustable totem just because uh, I feel like they're a little bit lighter and you need different type of brackets for those. With the Global Trust, you, know, you can just use regular clamps and put a TV mount and hang your TV. But um, again, we're gonna put this together and show you guys the differences. Um, another thing, let me go over here. The base plates on the truss are a lot heavier to carry. A little more dangerous, you know, you drop this one in your feet and you're done. <laughs> so this is one of the disadvantages with the photo. This one's, there's both of them right here, they're easy to carry. They're not as heavy, but they're very sturdy for uh, putting lights on top of the wooden heads. Right here you have the rest of the totem. As you guys can see, these are uh, pretty light. You can put them uh, on pretty much on any car easy to carry around. You need, for that you're gonna need all your pins. I'm just gonna use two as a sample. So this is annoying, it's loud, you can put on there. Put the little pin on the back. Put it all four quarters, same thing on the top. If you're gonna put a heavy light, put it on there. Make sure you guys get a little hammer like this one, these are more practical than the big ones. And of course, put the pin on the back of it. Same thing, put it on all four corners. As you can see, that's pretty easy, that's fast, which does one of the advantages for the totals. All right, fellas, so let me show you what's in the bags. This one has the, like I said, this one has the base plates. You have the bottom plate. A little nice uh, sponge divider, a sponge foam divider. Mm -hmm. 
The other bag will have the rest of the totem. So let's put it together and come back to this in a second. All right, so the other bag has the rest of the totem. It has the screens in here, it has the screws that we need. Also has a bag to put the screws in here, but I don't want to use it because I feel like I will drop the screws on it. So I pressure don't use that, I'll show you. I just put everything in a bag. So you have your black and white screen. Everything that you need here. I just put everything on a Ziploc bag, so something a little easier to add remove the screws that come with it. Let's put it together and see how long it takes us. These are pretty light compared to the one from Global Trust. Alright fellas, so they're both put together now and uh, let me show you the differences on the base plates. As you can see the Global Truss I believe is 24 by 24 and the one that is adjustable I think is 20 by 20. Okay so for the height of the adjustable as you guys can see we have about 68 and a quarter, 68 so that's 5 feet 8 inches. And 79 inches for this one, so that's six feet and eight, six feet seven inches for the other one. And for the bottom plate of the Global Trust, again, I was right, that's uh, two feet by two feet, that's 24 inches. And this other one is a little less than 20. All right, so let me show you how to raise them up. Uh, I'm actually going to go a little bit closer here. There's this little things here, these moving, all four of them. Make sure they stick out like this and you can lift it. And you can adjust to whatever height you want of them. If you want to keep it there, you keep it there. If not, go one more. Another thing, another advantage with the adjustable totem, it comes already with a uh, speaker, uh, you can say a uh, adapter, so you can put a speaker if you don't want to put a light. You can already come with it. And now you can throw a speaker right on top of that. With the, <clears throat> sorry, with the Global Trust you can do the same thing. I know it's a little bit high. You can get a smaller one, a little lower, a uh, shorter uh, totem. Or you can just drill a hole right in the middle, but you have to buy the adapter separately. All right, fellas, so the next thing we're gonna do is the screens. Uh, as you guys know, the adjustable totems come with, uh, with black or white. 
we're gonna be doing the uh, the white one today for the global trust what i have to do i have to buy separately uh, some screens i ended up buying from pro x there's many options online but um again uh, pro x is not paying me but i'm gonna use the pro x um for the global trust That was easy, right? That was done. Now with the other one. Alright, so now we're gonna put the screen for the global trust. For the global trust, you see here here we move the top plate. Because this one is a little tighter, so it's a little harder to kind of slide on there. I'm gonna show you guys have a better idea or faster how to put this on. I always take them off and put them away. As you guys can see, it gets dirty. <laughs> I have it here in my garage to try to keep it as clean as possible. But still dirty down on the bottom with all the rain. I'm trying not to make this video a little bit too long, but I know you guys have time right now to watch. <laughs> How long did that take me? Like six minutes. All right, fellas. So the last thing I'm gonna show you is just uh, with lights inside the truss. You guys get an idea of the differences uh, with the global truss. You might see a little bit of a pattern with the other ones pretty much uh, just straight up. So let me turn off the lights and see if you guys can see a difference. You see what I mean with the global truss? It's the same lights on both of them. Uh, I'm not sure why it's a little bit different on the other one. Once again, thank you for watching the videos. Make sure you guys comment, subscribe, hit the like button. Stay safe during, the, during this uh, coronavirus uh, thing going on. We're all pretty much in the same boat right now. We're all nervous, uh, scared, don't know what's gonna happen next. So let's just stay positive. 
I know um, a lot has happened the last couple of weeks. Um, all I can say, you guys stay safe, hang in there. We're gonna get through this. Um, thank you for watching the videos. Again, comment, subscribe. This is gonna help us uh, stay busy here in the meantime. Um, any questions, you guys know, put them down at the bottom. I'll try to reply as much as I can. Uh, this video was just meant for the people that have always asked me what are the differences on a regular Rockville totem, adjustable totem, and uh, Global Trust. So you can see the differences. They both have uh, pros and cons. Uh, the biggest one is the, um, the Rockville is easy to carry, move around. Takes a little, a little bit longer to set up. The Trust, the Global Trust, a little heavier to carry around and not as practical to carry on any car or SUV. Uh, it does take longer to put the screen, so pretty much setup time, I think together is almost the same if you're gonna be using uh, screams. If you're not gonna be using a screen with your totem, uh, it's gonna be a lot faster and also the advantage on the truss that you can always do um, different type of setups uh, if you have a whole bunch of them, if you have different adapters. Uh, thank you and I will see you guys on the next video. Stay safe.